Good evening and welcome to Friday the 9th of February. Barry Beer back with you on the Friday Raps and welcome along to you. Well, tonight we're going to be talking about the Australian car Holden, the Holden Commodore. And here is my upside and now, good evening to you. Good evening, Barry. Good evening, viewers. It's a good subject, Barry. Well, the horror, the Holden Company started in Australia in 1948, and 70 years later, it has ended. Well, the car that I remember is the Holden Commodore SLE. Now, do you remember that car? I remember it. Beautiful car, Barry. And the Holden Commodore station wagon that they were, they were good too. Yep. And well, uh, you could buy them in automatic or manual transmission. And the, 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 and what was the one you had? A uh, Holden Kingswood. A Holden Kingswood, they were great too. And Holden Premier. And the Holden Premier and the Holden Tirana. And they were the good old days. And the best of all, the Holden Statesman. And the best of all, the Holden Statesman. Now, if you've heard the poem, and there were four, four meat pies, kangaroos, and holding cars. Well, that was an old television commercial from the 70s. And there was a show called Kingswood Country, named after the Holden Kingswood. Here's my offside in now. Yeah, beauty, mate. Holden cars. They've been around for a long time. They've been in a lot of Australian shows. And, and now let's talk about the features of a Holden Commodore station wagon. Now, the Holden Commodore station wagon, you could either pick that up in automatic or manual transmission from your local Holden dealer. Now, the best car I liked was the station wagon because you could fit just about anything in those cars, even the kitchen sink, even put the back seat down on the car, in the car. So you can put your surfboard down on it and most of all, the Holden Kingswoods had a, a slot for cassette, ca, cassettes. So if you were bored of the rubbish music on the radio, all you had to do was grab a tape from the, 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 the uh, container, slip it in the tape player and away you go. What was your favourite tape? Um, I used to like Bird Bacharach. She uh, was good. Yeah, that was a man. Haven't you heard of Bird Bacharach? Uh, it was I'll a... have to play it for you one day, Baron. And um, Renee Gaya. Yep. Another good old days. And Johnny Young. Yep. Um, ACDC. Very good. What radio stations did they have in the old Holden? Okay, they... 2SM. 2SM. 2UW. 2UW, 2WS, and many others to follow. Yep. Today at FM, at Triple M, Triple J, you name it, it happened. And then coming up, we, uh, we're going to talk about the Holden Tirana. Now, that was 
and good car too. Here's my offsider. Yeah, they're beautiful cars, Barry. I think they started about 1968. Used to race them at Bathurst. GDR Tiranas. They were some of the fastest cars ever made. They were good, weren't they? Mm -hmm. A lot of fun. And and um, tonight also on the show we look back at the Toyota High Aces and the Coast as well. We don't see many of them around on the road anymore, nor the old coaster buses. The coaster buses had a gear stick which was either on the floor or on the steering wheel. And you just pull a handbrake up or pull it up, just like the vans we've got now. So, so the coasters, do you remember them? Yeah, I remember the coasters, Toyota coasters, Barry. They're a bit longer than normal vans. Yeah. You can fit a lot in them. Yeah, and also, um, we, we, um, we um, also remember the Nissan Urbans. Do you remember those? Yeah, I remember them, Barry. They were good. Maybe not as reliable as the Toyota Coaster, so. Well, and we always touch on about this on the show, and that is not ringing triple zero unless you have an emergency. Here's my offside in now. Very good advice, Barry. Especially if it's not an emergency. Leave the ambulances for the real emergencies. You might save someone's life. Because the wrong call could cost someone their life. Mm -hmm. And you don't want that. Well, coming up, we have the weather forecast right now, and it's a bit of boom crash opera, I think, out there. Here's my offsider. Yeah, be careful if you're driving, and uh, leave your lights on, drive slowly, put the windscreen wipers on fast, and please be patient, because it's better to get there alive than not at all. And don't have a road rage attack either. It doesn't work like that with my offsider and I'm on this program. So that's where we must leave the story of Holden for the time being. Thanks for joining us on the Holden special. Now, there was a person called Mark Holden. He, he was a doctor. Remember him, Mark Holden? I remember him. He's on a TV show. Yeah, the Mark Holden special, boy, I believe. And he was a singer as well, wasn't he? Yep. What song did he sing? I want you to be my lady. That's right. Good song. So, join us for our regular lineup of um, topics tomorrow. And tomorrow we've got a big day coming up. We've got some new stuff here tonight, and we've got two new managers. Welcome to both those new managers and the start new stuff just keep on coming. So from me, Barry Fear and my off side up, we wish you a very good night and here is my offsider now to say good night. Yeah, good night Barry, good night viewers and remember, be careful out there. And don't dial Triple zero unless you have an emergency. Good night, everybody. Good night, Oceana.
Good night, everyone on the northern beaches. See you tomorrow. Good night.